right? Uh, it is. It sounds very simple, but these are the things that actually work, right? You need to find a system that you are comfortable with, a proven system, and then you focus on getting that business up. Okay. Some people, even before they have their first website up online, they want to get the second and third one up. I think that is the wrong way of doing it. You have got to focus on getting the first website up, the first product up, the first business up. And, you know, uh, for example, one of the most effective ways of starting is to create a master business plan for your own business. A basic business plan. Uh, the business plan may be anything like uh, something on paper, on, on your whiteboard, you know, the market that you get into, the product that you want, or the model that you want to make money with. Uh, having a plan really helps to guide you along the way. And the trick of focusing on the plan and cutting back on information overload is, you know, when you look at the plan, anything that comes along that takes you away from your plan, you you have better stay away from it. For example, if you decide on doing affiliate marketing as a model, and if something comes along like uh, eBay, the latest hype up product on eBay comes along, if you know that it's not going to help you in your affiliate marketing plan, your model, then don't get it, right? If you get it, you're only going to get distracted. You're only going to get uh, spend some wasted time on pursuing another another product that you wouldn't uh, be wasting time on, basically. So you know, but if something comes along and it helps you in your business, for instance, you know, uh, a cool software comes along that allows you to uh, make uh, multiple sales instead of one, and you know that it's going to help in your main business, then you take that into uh, your consideration, right? So you keep everything very focused. There's no secret to success, okay? There's no secret. The secret is really in taking action and being focused on taking the action, right? Be committed to your model, your system, right? So I hope everyone takes this advice, um, take this advice and apply it. And there's really no difference between me and you, right? Uh, I wasn't born with a laptop on my lap. You no, know, I wasn't born rich. You no, know, I come from a very poor family. Okay, but what I do have in me that makes me different is that I take action. Okay, uh, during those five years, I didn't spend my time just learning. I spent a lot of the time applying what I learned. Okay, applying what I learned. So, for instance, uh, if I just discovered that hey, there's such a thing as an opt-in form, I wouldn't do nothing about it. I would actually learn how to apply it. And I screw up along the way many, many times. I got things wrong. But that is not the important thing. The important thing is once you apply it, you learn a skill. A skill that can take you, uh, that can allow you to make money with for a lifetime. So some people, they have an issue of not being able to create websites. They don't know how to create a website. And you know, frankly, I tell them that it's either a time or money factor. If you have the time, please by all means learn all you can about it and get your own website up because this is going to be a skill that you can monetize on for the rest of your life. Right? But if you have the money, outsource it. Right? But I still encourage people to learn the skill because uh, when, no, when the rubber meets the root, it's the skills that you have that's going to determine your success. Right? So learn whatever you need to, the important things. And you do not need to know a lot in order to make money, right? You do not need to know a lot. For for example, I am a technical idiot, right? I am really really bad at technical stuff. Ask me about FTP and I give up. Okay, I can't explain FTP to you. What I do is I learn only the basic things, right? The very basic. I upload my files by the control panel, which is really simple. Okay, and uh, I know only the important things that's going to make me dangerous enough of the important, the important basic skills. So uh, if you're starting out, you know, you have to realize that you do not need to know everything. Okay, just know the essential elements. And you know, uh, my good friend Marlon Sanders, right, one of the uh, pioneers of internet marketing, you know, he has a phrase that is very, very true. He says, you no, know, you do not need to get it perfect. You just need to get it going. Okay, and this is something, a mantra, that I have lived with uh, since the day I started out. You do not have to get it perfect, right? Because if you're going to be a perfectionist and make everything perfect before you launch your site 
or before you launch your product, well, guess what? You're never going to get it launched. You're never going to get it launched. Uh, so, you know, just go ahead and get it going. And even if you make mistakes, it's perfectly fine because you can tweak it along the way. You know, even, uh, the, when I first started out, even though I made a lot of mistakes, but I still managed to start building my first list. I still managed to start making money on the internet, right? And this is something that happened even though I screw everything up. So, no, it's nothing. Uh, you do not need to be a genius, okay, to make money online. And you do not need to have any special talents. You do not need to look especially good, right? You do not need to be tall or short. Look, I'm, a, I'm a short guy. I'm a pretty short guy, but that doesn't really bother me because the internet is really a level playing field for everyone. It is a level playing field. Right? And on the internet, there is no racism, right? there is no biasness.